guys and welcome back. So today is going to be my day one of a hair growth challenge. If you want to know what I've mixed in this bottle for my hair growth challenge month in other words, then please keep watching. got here three ingredients that has been roaming all over the internet which my mom and her mom and her mom's mom told me about but I never really used to try it because I never tried it and I am a skeptic myself but apparently these three ingredients is going to help increase hair growth okay so I've got all of my ingredients here this is just going to be the container that I'm going to mix my ingredients with so let's get started okay dokey so the first ingredient is going to be the placenta now just a fair warning with the container of the um, placenta it is glass if you want to break the ampule please use a safety something i don't want you guys to get cut trust me to get cut is very easy with this now the benefits of placenta is it helps and increase the hair follicle growth, it decreases shedding and then um, it helps to cure um, hair thinning and baldness and then of course um, increases blood flows to the hair follicle as well. Now the second ingredient is going to be my bergamot essence, I'm going to use 2.5 mils. Now, it, bergamot essence helps to facilitate wound healing, it helps to reduce inflammation, it may help promote hair growth and a healthy scalp, and studies have shown that it also displays antimicrobial activity when applied to the scalp. Now, the last ingredient is also bay rum. I'm also going to use 2.5 mils of it, and it actually has been used for ages to aid hair growth, um, the ingredients in bay rum itself stimulates the skin and scalp producing more hair resulting in thicker and fuller hair and it is also helpful in hydrating your skin therefore preventing dandruff. Now I just put in the rest of the placenta. So I've basically just mixed everything together and I'm going to show you the texture of it now. So it's got a very strong smell, a very fresh smell. So this is how the texture looks like. It's slight, it's between oily and watery. So it's it's exactly in between. Now I have made four bottles of this mixture and I'm going to put this on my scalp and let me show you guys how I'm going to do it. So I'm just going to take a tiny, tiny bit and I'm going to put it on some cotton wool. So I'm not going to apply a lot on it because I don't want to get my hair too oily. The bay rum is a bit of an oily substance so I need to stretch out my hair wash days guys. Now as you can see I only concentrate on my scalp area. That is the only place I'm going to put these ingredients or this mixture after I've applied it I'm just going to comb through my hair and then I'm going to put a little bit on my hand I'm just going to massage it in my um, scalp as well That is about it guys. I'm just going to put it on my scalp and then I'm just going to massage it and I'm going to do this every evening before I go to bed and I usually only wash my hair once a week but I'm going to have to do it twice a week for this month to see or to prevent off my hair to get too oily because the bay rum is a bit of an oily substance and um, I don't want to sit with oily 
hair or oily roots and specifically so i'm going to wash my hair twice a week every evening i'm just going to put it on massage my scalp and we'll see how this works that is about it guys thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this video then please do give it a thumbs up and if you have any questions please do comment down below and then of course if you want to see more of my videos then please do subscribe to my channel it is highly appreciated and then I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.